let's see construction and working of master cylinder master cylinder is one of part of hydraulic braking system it is used in hydraulic braking system to uh, build up pressure of the hydraulic fluid so let's see first construction the uh, fluid reservoir is here to store fluid air vent is there for uh, ventilation of the air inside the fluid reservoir there is intake port one bypass port is used this is piston and our brake pedal is connected here the push rod is rubber boot to prevent the dust and dirt particles to come inside our master cylinder system or we can say hydraulic braking system this is fluid check wall here the fluid check wall is nothing but pressure relief wall when certain amount of pressure is uh, built up in compression chamber the fluid check wall automatically opens and the uh, brake pedal goes to the line uh, again this is return spring we used to return the piston when driver releases the pedal there is a seal here is also one seal these are two seals here is one piston hole uh, for what it is used i will tell you later uh, so this is body this is it construction goal so let's see how master cylinder works in hydraulic braking system so here is driver uh, brake pedal when driver presses the brake pedal the push rod moves towards his leg so due to this this piston also moves towards his leg when piston moving towards his leg it covers the both bypass port as well as intake port so fluid plumb fluid reservoir doesn't come to the compression chamber and vice versa compression chamber fluid does not go to the fluid reservoir so again when the piston comes towards his leg it starts compressing the fluid inside the compression chamber so when certain amount of pressure is built up inside the fluid of compression chamber the fluid check wall opens so the fluid compressed fluid inside the chamber flows towards the brake line or we can say brake linings of the hydraulic fluid system so uh, when driver releases the pedal automatically piston starts going towards our right because of the spring so when piston goes towards the right some cavity or some vacuum is generated inside the compressed chamber and vacuum is a chance of chance to air to come inside the master cylinder system or we can say hydraulic braking system and it fails the system because air is one of the criteria to failing or failure of this hydraulic braking system so to avoid this when uh, piston move towards his right some fluid hydraulic fluid from reservoir comes to this compression chamber from this intake port from this intake port it comes to this uh, piston hole and from this little slot it comes inside the compression chamber and fulfill the uh, vacuum created inside the compression chamber so when again the uh, piston start moving towards this side uh, the return fluid from line brake linings come inside the compression chamber so in compression chamber there is excess fluid so the return fluid also and fluid come from reservoir intake port by piston hole to the compression chamber also so when the fluid amount of fluid in, uh, inside the compression chamber increases bypass port opens and automatically excess fluid from this compression chamber go towards the fluid reservoir and the this is the simple construction and working of master cylinder if you really understand the construction and working of master cylinder please do comment like and share do not forget to subscribe my channel thank you